when you subscribe we will use the information you provide to send you these newsletters. Sometimes they'll include recommendations for other related newsletters or services we offer. Our privacy notice explains more about how we use your data, and your rights. You can unsubscribe at any time. Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury exchanged contracts earlier this week for a potential bout this summer in former world heavyweight. Champion Mike Tyson had weighed in on how he feels the fight will play out. Joshua beat Karat Pulev to defend his WBA, WBO, IBF and Debo heavyweight straps last month. If the Brit can convince WBO mandatory Oleksandr Usyk to delay his mandatory title shot then he will have a clear path to fight Fury. The Gypsy King stunned Deontay Wilder to claim the WBC belt last year and he is snubbing a trilogy against the American to set up a unification showdown with Joshua. Both fighters have verbally agreed to share the purse 50, 50 and the fight could be wrapped up over the coming weeks. Joshua vs Fury will be one of the most eagerly anticipated bouts of all time but Tyson reckons AJ has a worrying trait which could cost him dearly. It's very interesting, Joshua is a masterful puncher. But you can see his punches coming, he telegraphs his punches. Tyson told Eddie Hearns no passion, no point podcast. And that's just a recipe for disaster if you're fighting Tyson Fury and you're telegraphing your punches. To a guy who's 6 feet 7, come on. The heavyweight division has a number of top stars waiting for their shot at Joshua and Fury. I think there are a lot of great heavyweight fighters in the division. Anyone who says that it's a bad division is just jealous. It's exciting, Tyson added. Tyson can fight Wilder again and I like to see guys fight each other over and over again. If they're exciting fighters. Wilder did make mistakes, but if the fans want it, that's what it's all about. Tyson Fury is a fan fighter. The fans are in love with him, he has the momentum now. In England, Anthony Joshua is a big thing. But Tyson Fury has got the people now, he's got the masses. They follow him like he's a messiah. Joshua's promoter Hearn recently provided an update on how talks with Fury's camp are going. The first draft of the contract has now gone out to Bob Arum, Fury's promoter, which is obviously a good thing, he told the Daily Mail. The contract reflects the positive nature of the discussions we have had so far around this fight. We now await their comments before we all move on to agreeing a location. We hope to have something signed within the next two weeks.